Welcome, welcome from the north, south, east, and west. We're all the way from the Midwest, Kansas City, Missouri, home of the Chiefs, the Royals, and Love is Key. We are Love is Key Catering and Food Truck. I am co-owner Tamisha Martin. I'm Cameron Martin, the other co-owner. And I'm Tangela Henderson, our head chef. Hold, hold on, wait, 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 wait. We gotta do this. This is not just Chef Tan. This is extraordinary sweets galore patty pies who we got tangible in the building had to say that had to say that yes so today we're so excited we're gonna make our most famous dish what we call the southern bell and that is our twist on chicken and waffles in addition we're gonna make a classic breakfast sandwich a blt but our addition with our most famous cake waffle in addition we're gonna make how this all started a caramel cake and so we're gonna start off with the chicken um and we're gonna have Cam go ahead and show us how that's done. Oh, we already know how it's done. So you know we got the chicken, gotta have our seasoning with the with the chicken. That's that's important. And then you have our our flour. Tamisha, you wanna tell them a little bit about yeah, that flour? So we do we use a flour base um, with Louisiana and of course our seasoning, which you can purchase online at loveiskkc.com. You cannot get this anywhere but from us. These are fresh ingredients, no salt but we bring the flavor hard. And so we typically, um, it's up to you. We know there's a lot of dairy um, issues nowadays. And so we don't necessarily soak our chicken. However, it's still gonna have that buttermilk, um, juicy, but crunchy flavor. Um, and so we typically just mix it in the flour mix um, with our seasoning before. So we went ahead and actually seasoned the chicken with our seasoning as well. Um, and then Cameron is gonna drop that um, and some hot grease, and it's gonna be golden, beautiful chicken for you. And so we're gonna transition over to the, the fryer in just a minute. Before we transition though, we gotta say a little bit. We from Missouri. Missouri a little slow to chicken and waffles. The South, they already was, they, they hip on uh, this delicacy, but the Midwest, Missouri, but they coming around though. So we're gonna drop this in this grease. So that chicken typically takes about 10 to 12 minutes to fry. And so while we're frying that, we're gonna get the waffle uh, going for you. So we'll be right back. All right, welcome back. And so right now we're gonna work on our cake waffle. I'm sorry, we don't have anything against the French, but this is not a, your normal Belgian waffle. We do what we call a cake waffle. So it is our special waffle batter. Um, that you cannot get anywhere else from lovingskkc.com um, and in Kansas City as well. And so this is our own special recipe. We have Chef Tan over here um, mixing up this waffle batter. Um, we typically use condensed milk, we use evaporated milk, uh, egg, and water. Um, and so that's what she's doing over there. If you wanna add anything to it um, and show them our mixture is very light and fluffy, right. just like a cake, it is not dense. Um, but it's gonna be the best waffle you've ever tasted before. Right. And so we're gonna go ahead and get this waffle machine greased up for you so we can show you um, our waffle. All right. And we do use pound. I mean, it's nothing special, but this waffle is something special. <laughs> All right, this waffle is gonna take about two minutes. Go. While the waffle is cooking, um, we're gonna actually build the BLT for you. Um, so we'll be right back and get those fresh ingredients for you. All right, welcome back. So now we're gonna build our version of a BLT. So we have our fluffy, delicious waffle right here. Chef Tan, if you wanna cut that in half for us. Um, so we start off with our waffle. Um, we do also use our caramelized sauce, which we're going to show you how to make that in a little bit as well. Uh, but if you want to use that one already that's pre-made right here, um, just drizzle a little bit on there. And while she's doing that, we have two bacons. So we know there's a lot of people that don't like pork. We get it. Um, some of us don't eat pork as well. So we're going to start off with a turkey BLT, some thick sliced uh, turkey bacon. We have some smoked uh, turkey deli meat, and that's what we're gonna start with. So we're gonna start with the deli meat right here first. 
So we like thick sandwiches. So this is gonna be nice and thick, um, lots of meat. And then we're gonna get those veggies. You can add some more. And then we have the nice thick sliced turkey bacon that we're gonna add on here. Um, and then we do use uh, beef steak tomatoes. Uh, we have some cut if you wanna slice some more up. Um, fresh, so we have the green thumb here. She has a beautiful garden. Every year we have so many delicious tomatoes that grow. Um, and so we use beef steak tomatoes that we stack on there. In addition, we use a organic um, lettuce mixture. It has the purple and the green, so it brings such beautiful color to the um, to the sandwich, but also some nice crunch as well. All right. So this is your turkey BLT. So you have the smoked turkey, the thick sliced turkey, bacon, tomato, and lettuce. This is a delicious turkey BLT. I'm telling you, you can't get this anywhere. All right, so our next is the pork BLT. You wanna go ahead and slice that as well. Um, this is the classic. You can't go wrong with pork bacon. This is some nicely crisp hickory smoke Turk, um, pork bacon. We're gonna drizzle it with the caramel. Add the pork bacon. Add the lettuce and tomato. Nothing like a good old BLT. have it of pork BLT. So these two sandwiches, um, classic twist on BLTs. All right, next we'll be talking about the drizzle that we actually uh, drizzled on that sandwich is a caramelized syrup that we make in house. Um, it's not your traditional syrup. Um, it's a vanilla base and it's delicious. And so we're gonna have Chef Tan whip some of that and show you how that's done as well. But all of these ingredients that we're making, the caramel, the seasoning, the waffle batter, is all purchased on our website, lovespkc.com. Um, we'll be right back to show you how to actually get this caramel um, with the. We are back. I have Chef Tan here. We are going to talk about our amazing caramel cake. But first, a lot of people don't know, we are known for sweets. I know in the Midwest, we're known for chicken and waffles, but outside of that, people don't know that we are known for sweets. So, Chef Tan, we will talk about what is in this caramel cake that's so addictive. Well, the caramel cake, it has a lot of butter, sugar, flavor, vanilla flavor. And so, that's what makes the caramel cake. Okay. And a little bit of, a whole lot of love. Now, in order for that caramel cake, you have to have the caramel icing. The caramel icing is the major part of the caramel cake. And so, the ingredients for the caramel cake, for the caramel, um, it's not a whole lot, but it's a lot. Uh, you want to melt butter, you have your butter, your real butter. I have your real butter. Uh, you have to have your white sugar, and you're gonna also need brown sugar. You're gonna put those together, melt it, let it simmer a little bit, and then after that, you're gonna need condensed milk, pet milk, and condensed milk, okay? And you're also gonna need vanilla flavor, vanilla flavor. And combine these all together, stir, let it simmer a little bit until you come out with a consistency like this. Like that, look at that. Famous caramel. Okay, okay. Uh, and so, this is actually the background of the caramel cake. So, there you have it. Okay, I will say it's a little addictive because I didn't even like caramel opposed to having this caramel cake, so I know it's something there. She's not telling all the ingredients, but we can't tell y'all everything. But I kind of want to go back. What kind of started you into cooking? I know people don't know we are family you are my mother mother-in-law so what started you cooking well i've been cooking for a very long time my mom i was always in the kitchen 
when she was cooking. Uh, and it was just a, a regular routine. I'm in the kitchen, I'm 9, 10, and I wanna see all the ingredients that's going on with the cooking. So that's how I started. And our family was kind of more based around, everything involved food. So this is where we're at today, food. Unfortunately, she's not here to help us celebrate it, but she's here in spirit. So there you have it. This is where Love is Key comes from, the baking, the cooking, all the love, food. Yes, I definitely had a pleasure of meeting Miss Daisy before, you know, she's for her passing. But I also want to talk about you was born in Kansas City, Missouri, but you have a lot of roots in the South. Can you yeah. talk a little bit about that? Yeah, my mom is from Arkansas, my dad is from Louisiana. So those two mixes together, you can't go wrong with food. It's a combination of all types of different types of food and desserts. So putting that together, it brings up what we're having today uh, with Love is Key. So uh, just a lot of love, food, all types of backgrounds of different types of food. That That's what makes Love is Key. So, there you have it. I will say that um, the ingredients that we didn't talk about is love, and that's why Love is Key is the name. So we'll be right back. All right, welcome back. We have everything that we've shown you all today. Let's recap. So we started off um, with Chef Cam in, with the chicken and waffles. Look you at that. Say? Boy, look at that chicken and waffles. You gotta, when they get a close up on this, you're going to see everything. You got the waffles, you got the caramel drizzle on there you got the see people don't know this part you got the caramel drizzle on the chicken too that's what that's what hits as well yeah that salt and sweet uh combination is the perfect so chicken and waffles then we came uh to the blts our twist the uh, waffle blt so we have the pork one right here with that thick sliced hickory smoked bacon um and those that don't like pork we have the turkey blt so delicious with the steak tomatoes and the organic um, spinach and lettuce mixture. Um, and then to sum it up with the dessert, mm. we have this <laughs> wonderful caramel butt cake. Yes, and so let's let's show them this caramel. So once everything is done, you gotta sauce it up. You gotta drizzle it. Um, and this is really what makes the chicken and waffles, the BLT, and the cake. Don't be shy, get it in there. Uh, this All beautiful right. butter cake, for those that don't really know how to bake from scratch, we use the Betty Crocker uh, butter cake um, with all those fresh ingredients and topped it with this beautiful, beautiful caramel. Mm -hmm. um, let's top the, the BLT as well with the caramel. Uh, that caramel right there um, is so delicious. It's the perfect combination with any of our meals. Um, but let's do a taste test because, I mean, all this delicious food, we got to taste some. So I'm, I'm going to go ahead and take a piece of cake. Take a piece of that cake. Right? I'm going to take a piece of cake. You want to share a piece of cake sure. with me? Sure. All right. Let's do it. Kim, what you going to taste? You know, I'm going to do my chicken and waffles. I'm going to make sure that's right. All right. Let's taste it. All right. Melting in your mouth, ain't it? This is the hit. There you that was good. We, right. We knew this was a hit when one of our... Um, our customer said she sleep with this cake. I said, what? She, she didn't sleeper. want her grandkids um, or her, her kids that live with her to eat the, eat the cake. And so she put it in a bed with her. You can't get this nowhere. This is fire. All right, Kim, tell us about the chicken waffles. Hold on, so you got it got that right amount of crunch on there. I hope they don't zoom in to see this. So let's let's get that. Oh, I hear that crunch. Right. You hear that crunch, don't you? We got mix it. We mix it in with the caramel as well. That's good. I'm we'll also take a piece of the waffle. Fire. Heaven. It's heaven. So uh, all of our products, the seasoning that we put on the chicken, on our website, our waffle batter, our caramel drizzle. Come check us out on Facebook, Instagram. Um, our website, Love is Key KC. If you in the Midwest, if you in KC, whether you come to see the Chiefs, the Royals, come check us out. Um, and this is a cooking show where we talk about food kingdom, uh, the, the God's kingdom, and the Chiefs kingdom. This episode, we didn't talk about the Chiefs, but later on we will. Um, but the verse of the day is 1 Corinthians uh, 10 and 31. Whether you eat or drink, no matter what you do, always glorify God. And that's what we're here to do. We're here to build the kingdom, prepare food, and serve our community. So check us out, loveiskeykc.com. Thank you. Yeah.